The Summit Eastern Edition is a new pop-up series that brings together the masterminds behind Polang, The Summit, SOM, SFNY, The Wild Truck, and a bunch of other creative collaborations to celebrate the unsung and unheralded San Francisco chef. Where we're hosting the pop-up is at Vinyl Cafe, which is technically the Western Edition. And so we thought it would be really kind of cool and a play of words by calling it the Eastern Edition since the food is all focused on, on Asian, which is the East. It's kind of a homecoming for us. Um, if you look at the map, you'll find that Vinyl Cafe is in the same neighborhood where Polang Lounge is located. We're a few years away from rebuilding the summit. And instead of uh, sitting around and waiting for the summit to uh, reappear, we thought that we should celebrate the spirit of the summit, which is basically bringing people together, either through food, through music, through creative entrepreneurial projects, and we just want to rebuild our community. So the Unsung Heroes concept is just paying homage to the people who have, you know, put food where it is today, the underground cooks, the small restaurant owners, the Giros of the world, you know, our moms who would have loved to have a restaurant but didn't have the opportunity to, and just kind of give, pay homage to them. And so the whole Eastern Edition concept is trying to bridge that gap. Eastern Edition, uh, we plan to, to explore the regions of Japan, Burma, the Philippines, Vietnam, you know, I have some, some friends and, and some favorite people that I really would like to learn from and work with and, and hopefully um, uh, share that with, with everyone. And so, I actually made an app. They're part of the Pop Culture Network. JCR. There's another one. There's another one. There was another one. There was another one. Um, there's very few people who do the business side and the art side, and, or, or vice versa. So, just like you're so busy, caught up on the day to day stuff, if you don't have a dedicated team helping you put your stuff out there, you're, you're stuck in the back making awesome stuff, but no one might never know about it. I just think they'll be really excited to be able to get out there and, and see what, um, you know, hopefully what a difference it makes when, when you have a support system. So, we'll create the menu that's. Um, you know that we can do that that can accommodate yeah. even the fish let's say if even if we have only limited orders yeah. so if they come early they can get the fish but then we, after 12 orders sold out we don't want to overcook on the sour crop mm -hmm. sour overcook is messy and then so a lot of strong taste come out yeah. and we like to cook right on when we heat it up we don't want to put it with the pork at the beginning we cook the pork fast and then right before at the end we put the sour crop so so that no if you hadn't told me about this pumpkin dish when I see it on the menu, I wouldn't order it. Yeah. But then he was just like, hey, try, you should try the pumpkin. I said, one time when you tried the pumpkin, now every time I come here, I have to get the pumpkin. I but know. <laughs> it's just the most you know, flavorful preparation. You make it seem so simple and easy, but then it's just like, yeah. You know, we're trying to bring people together, basically emanating from our love of music, but also from a love of other things that we really like to share with people. Food, art, creative things, you know. And that's what we're trying to do here at Eastern Edition. You know, we're trying to make a community revolving mainly around food this time. But the real benefit to donating to our Kickstarter fund is helping entrepreneurs and restaurateurs who don't have the resources to share their craft. And their craft happens to be the food from their heart. So let's build a new community around in Kickstarter and make the Eastern Edition happen. Mm -hmm.